I worked with Kim. She directed me twice. Oh, really? Yeah, she directed me on a House of Pain. Oh. And um, was the other? Kenan and Nikel. And Alexis was on one of those shows That's too, right. I think, Alexis at the time. And, with and I worked with actor Johnny Brown, who played building superintendent Nathan Bookman on the 1970s sitcom Good Times Has Died, according to an Instagram post from his daughter, Sharon Brown. He was 84 and died on March 2, his daughter said. It's too terrible. It will never not be. It's a shock. He was literally snatched out of our lives. It's not real for us yet, Sharon Brown. An actor and composer wrote Friday, so there will be more to say but not now. Dad was the absolute best. We love him so very much. You know, we could be by ourselves, have a little privacy. I knew I splashed on too much brute. It's <laughs> Woods. Yeah. You know, I'm a married man. You know, I shouldn't be fooling around like this. Good Times was a spin-off from Maud and centered on the Evans family, led by matriarch Florida Esther Roll in a Chicago housing project. It also featured Jimmy Walker, who became famous for his trademark dynamite, phrase, and young Janet Jackson. In addition to his four-year run on the show, Brown frequently appeared on Rowan and Martin's Laugh-In and enjoyed a lengthy singing and stage career. Other credits include The Flip Wilson Show, The Jeffersons, and Martin. He appeared on Broadway with Sammy Davis Jr. and Cicely Tyson in the 1960s. A Cause of Death was not made available.